Hello viewers, you're here watching this video with Hespin in the future. This is the first video I've recorded in general uh, since college started, officially started for the, for the fall. It's been three or four days now. Huh. I haven't had time to record videos. But, I have been playing in my off time Sims that I played too. Uh, you know, side stuff. So that I was playing on doing that camera. And I started to do. I started to do an experiment. I'm not done with the experiment yet. I'm kind of actually. I'm just preparing for it now. Where I'm gonna. It's got text. Uh, I'm gonna use. Okay. Okay. Um. I'm trying to record, so I'm trying to actually record an episode quick here. Possibly two. I'm not sure. I kind of, I, have, I do have some stuff to do today, but it's like, it's one o'clock, so I have time. And I want to actually do something. Oh, so, we're gonna, but what, what my, <laughs> what? I am crazy up here right now. Uh, my plan was to test just how good premium uh, cylinders are on my own. I'm not going to look it up. I'm not going to ask a friend. I'm going to find out for myself how worth it premium uh, cylinders are from get for getting from that one dude. Uh, premium cylinders, I got three from the, you know, getting your rank, getting your rank analyzed by the dude in, uh, freaking gold mouth. Argentum, whatever you want to call it. Uh, so I have a whole lot of premium cylinders now. Five of them. I got two. I got two from. Yeah, two. I got two from the guy that sold me them for the chain of keys. He keep and he won one of chain of keys, two silver cylinders and four gold cylinders. Now that's a lot of money to get all that stuff. Four golden cylinders and two silver cylinders. For one premium cylinder, I'm going to do a test to find out if that's worth it by using every single one that I have, every single uh, cylinder, uh, because I think it's worth it. I'm going to use silver cylinders until I have enough and then I'm going to make another premium cylinder. Sell all the treasure I have, write down the uh, amount of money I have, I already wrote it down, but I accidentally sold all my chain of keys that I was going to use to get more premium cylinders to test it. So I reset the game. <laughs> Big oops. Ah, uh, but yeah, I'm gonna yeah keep all my chain of keys this time, so I can make more premium cylinders and buy the exact amount of gold and silver cylinders I need to make as many premium cylinders as possible and use them all, and see if I've increased in money after selling the treasure. Now before I was also selling my collectibles. Bad idea. Collectibles are used for a lot of other things. Uh, treasure is also used for other things, but not as much. It's, they're more made for selling. I think. This is just what I've gotten. This is just what I, I feel like I've gathered. But, that's all gonna be done on my own time. I'm gonna explain the results of it when I'm done doing it on video. But that's gonna be done in my own time, because that's gonna take some time. And I don't, you guys wanna see me just salvaging constantly. So, we're gonna go back to Indel and do some talking to the goodest part and we're gonna we're gonna talk to people we're gonna talk to a lot of people there was a lot of people listening to talk to so we're gonna we're gonna go around meh long journeys make Tora tired refresh and sell out the again yo Soon will be big summit talk thing, yes? Friend will know friend know anything about suspicious things happening here? I've been really good the last few episodes with not stuttering when I'm talking to characters. When I'm talking when I'm voicing I'm not voicing them, I'm just reading them. When I'm reading out what they're saying. I've been good with not stuttering, but my mind is just a mess with college going on right now, so I'm not I, I'm gonna have more of trouble, alright? So just cut me some slack there. Ben will know about suspicious things happening there, yes. There's certainly something not quite right going on. 
I saw a very large wooden box being transported onto the Titan battleship. It was accounted for the inventory list, so I... Oh god, I was turned up way too loud. I'm sorry. I checked the audio, I saw that, and I didn't think anything of it. Again, I'm... I'm messed up in the mind right now, alright? There's so much happening right now, so much to think about. It was... It was accounted for the inventory list, so most of the colleagues think it's so, no problem, but honestly, I can't imagine what they would want such a huge box for. I'm worried about what might be inside. Much thanks. What? I'm trying to remember what happened last time. Uh, Mori came up to us and said something crazy is going on. She wants us to help, help her with it. Alright, big summit talk thing. Right, the summit talk between Moradin and Uriah. And Bono was going to do an assassination or something? Dude, it's not even been that long ago. It's been like three or four days. No, five or six days, actually, come to think of it. It's been a while since I played, since I recorded last. Uh, well, uh, I saw these w weird bird people. Not like Napon, a bit bigger than that. And, um, birdie looking like... Like this fella up here? You talking about this, but this big fella? I think I saw a picture of them before in a picture book, but I can't remember what they're called. Turkin, maybe? Oh, okay, okay. That could be it. That's it. They're called Turkin. Turkin are frickin'. They're gaining sentience. They're becoming intelligent beings. Thanks, that was really bugging me. But what would a bunch of Turkin be doing in a place like this? Thanks. <laughs> that answered her question. Alright, as call, what you got for me? Have you heard anything untoward go untoward? Going on at the Uriah or Uriah Ardanian summit? I do wonder. Myself as an Ardanian, yet I live under the protection of Indol. And the Uriahans and the Gormati here for instance, seem to get along just well. But just take a look at these lot. Clutching their tools with co of conflict and fixing one another with the coldest of stares. We can't even have a civil discussion short of holding a banquet like this. Do you think it's absurd? If they have the time to be wasting on such ex extravagances, they should use it to save their own suffering people. It does frustrate me. Sometimes I think the people running these na those nations could learn a thing or two from our camp. True. I would agree with this. How about you over there, sir? Hadeske. Yeah. There was one request I thought was decidedly suspicious. They We had a Napon fellow asking about supplies of poisonous substances. Bana? I told him we do not handle such items here. Of course, he left soon after. But from what I hear, he's been asking around other places, too. Who knows what he might be plotting? Poison. Bana's gonna poison. Mad bastard. Anyone else need talking to? I don't think it displays it on this map. Yeah, it doesn't. How about you, bucko? Oh, I have a good one for you. Do I want more info? <laughs> Some kind of ingredients with a monstrously foul odor was being carried into the Ardanian vessel. Titan vessel. The stench was so strong I can still smell it on my clothes. There are other ingredients too. Weird and wonderful, a lot of them. I don't know what they're, they're for, but it can't be your average recipes. Poison. Where am I going? Uh, if I go to quest log... How do I set story quests as my main quest? 
Wait, is this a story quest? I believe it is. I'm gonna... Yes. Find us up to something. Go to indoor gather information if you feature. Okay. There we are. There we are. Welcome to Godus, the capital of uh, the Goedus. Goedus. I don't know how to pronounce that word. Please use it. Uh, use it verbally, not in text. The capital of the Praetorius. Probably, they probably have it at some point. I just wasn't paying attention. Welcome to Goedus. I'm just going to call it Goedus. Even though it's definitely not what it's called. Go toys. Godies? I don't freaking know. The capital of the Praetorium of Indol. Hi there! The people of Indol live in peace and harmony, thanks to the peace of Amalthus, our beloved Praetor. Admittedly, our resources are somewhat strained due to the influx of refugees and foreign pilgrims. We appreciate your forbearance and hope you'll stay. You will enjoy your stay here despite any inconvenience. Alright. Well, there's apparently more people this way, so I'll go to here first. Get them Urians strutting their way down the dock. Alright, Olinda, what you got for me? Soon will be a big summit talk thing, yes? Friend will know any about suspicious things happening there. Perhaps there were untoward intentions on Moradain's side. Frankly, I would expect it. But I can assure you that we of Uriah have no intentions of trying anything funny. The word of Queen Rakura is absolute. We trust our queen and she wills it. We gladly put our weapons aside. There is no need for concern. Oh, I see. Of course, if the queen ordered me to take up arms, I would gladly fight tooth and nails against those Ardanian dogs. You would do well not to forget that. Much thanks. Okay. Cool. You, sir, are strange. <sighs> let's salvage! Actually, let's not, because I want to use my... my cylinders on a... a place where I'll actually get Chain of Keys, which is apparently, I looked it up, only in Gormont. Probably shouldn't be looking up things, but you know what? It's fine. Okay, what's this way? I'm assuming that's further down the dock? Welcome to Indol! Gotta stay vigilant. Stay vigilant. Yep. Calmed. You're this Ardenian fool. Hey, you heard anything suspicious going down at the Uriah Ardenian summit? Problems at the summit? A ridiculous notion. The summit will be held aboard this tight battleship, so we have no need to fear attacks from the outside. The door is the only entrance, and it will be not be opened until just before the summit to admit Queen Rakura. We have not allowed a single suspicious individual to pass this point. As such, there is no need to fear an attack with, from within either. But I know I'll find a way. Nice. Alright, set up. Alright, Arku. Ar. Ark. Oh! <laughs> Soon will be big summit talk thing, yes? Friend will know anything about, uh, about suspicious things happening there? The Ardanian Titan battleship has extremely sturdy defenses. I doubt there's a single weapon in this whole port that could damage it. Poison. Titan poison? Nah. Besides, I hear the main conference will only <laughs> will only be attended by a very select group of trustworthy individuals. 
I can't imagine how any miscreants could hope to get close to the VIPs to do harm to them, even if they wanted to. A lot of people are on edge, but I don't think there's anything to worry about. There's still more to talk to up there. Have you heard about anything going down at the Orion Summit? Boy! Nothing <laughs> untoward is going on in the Ardanian army, I assure you. Those who have come to Indol belong to Kareg Imperial Guard. Elite soldiers who have sworn solemn oaths to protect the Emperor. If anything suspicious were going on, I'd venture to say it would have to be on the Urian side. I find it difficult to tell what those people are thinking. Is this the last one? Alright. Runatio. Have you heard of anything go untoward going on at the Urian Ardanian Summit? In the current climate, I fear almost anything could happen. I can scarcely wait for the day when that huge, awful Titan battleship is gone from our shores. It pains me to see that such an unsightly structure in our beautiful city. I'm sure all upstanding inland citizens resent its presence. Why can Moradain and Uriah not cease all this foolish conflict and simply submit themselves to the will of Indel? There we go, it's done. Maybe it does look kind of ugly, but it's freaking massive. It's cool looking. I don't know. Oh, the Urian vessel is despawned. Huh. It's still not spawned. There it is! <laughs> Poor Titans. Oh. Sorry, sirs. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> if you have the camera zoomed in all the way and you have it to always be behind your character. It jerks around so fast. Oh my goodness gracious. The motion blur. The freaking motion blur. I slightly move the camera and it just completely, completely stops. That's funny. Alright. So what's over here that we're going to? The end. We've gathered quite a bit of information now. Yeah, and plenty of glantanty bogus. Plenty of it blatantly bogus. But there were some rumors in there that did bug me a bit. Time to sort out the real dirt from the baseless suspicion. Ooh, detective time. First, we clear up basic premise. Who is targeting Summit of Nations? Is former Chairman Bana? Is former Chairman Bana? Mastermind forget already? No, Tor, not that stupid. It's tradition, traditional for deducing things by listing information everybody know. Proper flow is for Rex Rex to think carefully and provide answer. Okay, okay. <laughs> On to the next basic premise, then. Where is Summit to be held? Hmm. We already knew, we already learned this. Yes, that's right. It seems like Bana is planning an assassination, but what method do you think he might be using? Uh, poison? That would be good. That would be awesome. I wish that happened, but poison. Actually, a method for leaves tampering with the food. But what poison would it be? I don't... I didn't, I didn't gain this information. I don't remember. Maybe.
All right. So is I wrong or right? Maybe it's a more effective method. Okay. I was wrong. Okay. I, I, I was probably giving that information and I just forgot. Or just wasn't paying enough attention. Probably imagine the VIPs preparing their own food. I'd like to see Morag and Bridget try to try cooking for the red carrot. As we saw in that heart to heart, bad idea. And someone was saying they'd seen a lot of weird ingredients being carried inside, right? Indeed they were. Right, 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 right. Could the strong flavored ingredients be to hide the taste of the poison? They're sharp, Rex. I bet, bet that's exactly what they're for. The only question left is who will be carrying out the poisoning itself? Let's see now. Turkin! The ones the girl's talking about? Bonnie used Turkin as minions before. Tor, remember from Artificial Blade Factory in Moradane, you're right! Mystery solved! Not solved quite yet, but I think. I, we know uh, like all the information now. We can tell they might be more inconvenient for the time professional assassins then. Yeah, what well, can you think Turkin know the first thing about cooking? I don't know about that. Listen, I think we're just going around circles here. If we know somebody's gonna poison the food, why don't we just go check out the battleship itself? itself? Good point. Regardless of who's carrying it out, we should act as fat. If we're gonna stop this plot. That's settled then. Everybody go to the dining hall of the Ardanian battleship. Let's go! Yeet! Wow, we only got 700 XP. Nothing else. Alright. I guess we're going into the battleship, even though they said that no one can come in. Except specific individuals. Are we sneaking in? Yeah, is the door just literally just open now? What? They said it would be closed until the very last second, and then they'll just open it and bring everyone in. I guess it's happening now, then? Let's just walk in. They don't care. Alright. There's the big bat. Excuse me? What's in the box? Hey, look what I found! Congratulations! It's going straight to the goal. No detours. Durgan! Stop everything! Hold it! What? Don't play dumb. Poison! That food is poisoned. P -p 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 poison? You kids crazy in brains. We're past talking. Quick, grab him! Yeah. That's not grabbing. That's stabbing, Rex. I'm switching out. Oh yeah, art spam. Okay, start off with stone. Oh, volcano. If I do volcano, then I'm gonna want rock. Alright, let's go. Nice. 
Whoa, big damage. Let's go Mithra. Dead. Okay, our Ar Arcra. Use some area of effect every now and then to lessen the load of the other enemies. Oh God, we're gonna have another rock. All right. Okay, start off with wind. If you start off with wind, we're not gonna end up with wind, right? Yeah, okay. So I'll probably continue with wind. If I can charge it in time? Okay, I guess they're not gonna char get charged. Wait, she got it. She got it. She got it. She got it. <coughs> Come on, let's just change the mythic then. Oh wait, we did miss it. Okay, I guess we missed it. There he is. Alright. This is gonna be it. Please wait. Papoonin! What are you doing here? What silly question! It Papoonin who hire world famous band of gourmet chefs, fire dragons! World famous? Gourmet chefs. Moradain, very insistent, want only very best food for important summit. Papoonin work wings to bone in finding chefs, and now what this? Uh. So you mean... These guys are... just a bunch of cooks. I did think they were not putting up much of a fight. Then this food is actually... Mate. <laughs> doing very expensive food now go to waste sorry we really did think they were here to murder someone murder what this nonsense friends talk I demand compensation friends have no idea how much time and money proponents spent on this but Vanna is still gonna an explosion with huh? a different from method. where Man, it's still up to something. Hey, what's going on? Explosion in the hangar! Right when everyone was busy with Queen Rakura's arrival. It's really bad. The Queen is here. This is it. Rex, we need to well, hurry. Yeah. Alright, so we just killed a bunch of chefs and left. Hey! Hey, 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 wait! Hey! No running away! Compensation! We just killed a bunch of chefs and left! <laughs> Alright. Sure. That wasn't very far. That's who was in the box. 
Who are you, villain? Is this some underhanded Ardadian trick? Wrong! But, but also, also right! Truth is complicated. Anyhow, here is where Queen died. If it looked like Queen killed by more Ardain, me in the money again! That voice... Banner, from the Argentum Guild. Correct! Tough marks for the Queen! But you were unseated as chairman. It's not so easy to get rid of Banner. Trade Guild of Argentum belong to Banner, down to last screw, last drop of oil! <sighs> Hold it, Banner! Yo, Rex! Nah! Banner not let Rex interfere with plans! Again and again! Banner not stand for this! Master Pun, that artificial blade! It... Rosa! Meh, meh, meh! Tora feel much greater power than before! Especially from Mark on forehead! What's going on? What's that? <laughs> Even Emperor comes straight to Banner. Convenient little mob to play. Come on, Banner. Cut the bad guy talk and accept you've lost. You know you won't get away with it, what with all these witnesses here. If Banner simply kill everyone, then nobody blab. Victory of Banner is a shock. You know, we can't let you do that! <laughs> you think you handle the power of a graded Giga Rosa? Things go very different this time! I'll play Rosa again. It was no fun last time. I'm waiting for uh someone to break before I topple. Oh shoot, I'm down the ground. Okay. Alright, I guess it's not happening. Hopefully Nia can get it and I won't have to just waiting for a break here. Okay. Good. We got it. We good. <laughs> no. Shoot, I used that too early. Oh wait, it resists it resisted break, so that's a thing. Alright, let's go all fire here. Alright, can you, when you... I already have mine to charge to three. Shoot, shoot. Alright, whatever. I guess we're doing... I guess we're doing this now. Nice! So if we use another fire... Help, please. Burn out. 
Uh, the hope is that I get to charge. Yes, topple. Ah, oh, I try to scare him. Yes, thank you for launching him. Get, get that thing out of my sight. I got this. Okay, let's get to level four. Oh, what? I need to recharge it now. I've never used her to level four, especially as like a final in a combo. No, no! I pressed the R! I pressed A too hard. I pressed A too hard. And, and it, when it didn't work, I pushed A harder again, and this time it pushed ZR. Okay. I guess I'll use it anyways. What crap. I'm on the ground. I got a green going around him. So a mega eruption I'll use. Even though he started with stone, hopefully he'll be able to recharge it in time. That's that's the hope. And then, if we can get a stone on top of that and then do a chain attack. That's gonna be some massive damage. If if it doesn't work out last second I'm gonna use volcanic storm. Alright. Wait, I can't use Volcanic Storm! Alright, use Stone. Let's retry this, this time. I'm gonna wait the maximum amount of time I can wait for Stone, so he can recharge. Go for it. What? Okay, now please finish charging Mega Eruption. You have time. I swear, you have time. Not for on the ground, though. Yeah, I was just mashing ZR and ZL and ZR. I just wanted to use something at least at this point. Since clearly, Tora is not going to be able to recharge it in time. Just at all. Uh, let's finish him off. I wanted to get a fourth in there, but it was not fated as such. Keep up. 
We're gonna break that water. I'm not the greatest. Whoa! No, I missed! Not the greatest at figuring out what I should be using. There we go, it's dead. I have to use this. Nice. Working on it. Awesome. Maximum burst. Let's just do random ones now. Good lord. Nice, alright. Pouch expansion kit! We got two rare core crystals too. Good. We'll do openings after this, how about? That wasn't even that hard. How? Even Giga Rosa defeated by these nasty meddling kids. This ends here, Bada. You are under arrest. The Praetorium will handle the judgment. Assassination is a serious matter. Your sentence will be harsh. So the mercantile genius Banner meets an inglorious end before my very eyes. Pitiful. Uh. Banner is... Hmm? Banner is not kind of man to go down like this. Uh, Run! If I go down, Run! I take you with me! Watch out! Don't go for him! Aegeon! As you wish. Distract? I'm not sure I... N no My lady, you cannot. There's still time. Hurry! Yes, my lady. There are more of them! Where? What do you say? This way! The rest of you should get to safety. Chum! I'm on it! Just a kid. 
Is she gonna? What's she doing? Is he she healing her? Him? Him? What is? Gonna be fine. Nia has. What do you mean? Imagined it. You got us all in a proper tizzy. My apologies. I thought I spied silhouettes. I did not mean to cause trouble. She healed him, but she had like another form to her. Hey, you guys! What? His Majesty the Emperor is awake. What? Can yeah, it they're be? gonna be really confused. His blade died and everything. He. Majesty. What? I don't. I don't understand. What was that? I apologize for making you worry. Majesty! It's... it's a miracle. When Aegean returned to his core, I was certain we had lost you. Honestly, you call yourselves soldiers. First aid? Anyone who'd have it. But... his wounds... <laughs> Just scratches. Nothing me and Dromark can't handle. You saved. <laughs> but <laughs> thank you, Nia. I truly don't know how to. I will never be able to repay you for what you. Oh, don't sweat it. Let's just say you owe me when. That'll do fine. She right? has another form. Nia. Since when did she have this? If she had this all along, she could have used it on friggin' Vandom, right? I mean, I guess that's not as big a figure as Emperor Nile was. But. You shouldn't be up. It's only been one day. Please don't strain yourself. Half a day off, and look at all this paperwork. I swear, it's like they don't want me to sleep at all. Majesty. Special Inquisitor, I hereby issue you new orders. It is my wish that you travel with the Aegis yep, okay, as an emissary of the Empire. Guard her, and defend her against her enemies until she reaches Tantal. Guard the Aegis? Shoot! I've already discussed it with his eminence. I'll do the next episode, okay. Forgive me, your majesty, oh. I cannot accept. Just think about what happened yesterday. It would be sheer foolishness for me to leave your side. I don't, I don't know. Is that so? I don't think so. Huh? I can see it in your eyes. It's clear that the Aegis, or rather, that boy, has made a great impression on you. That's not. I am your special inquisitor. Ensuring your majesty's safety is my only concern. To abandon that duty and go traveling. Is this... Aegeons? A driver who cannot even protect himself is no driver at all. Yesterday's events have made me keenly aware that I have no aptitude for it. It will be of more oh, use in your hey, hands. Oh, hey, we gonna get that boy. Majesty. Cool. The world is changing, Morag. I trust you more than anyone to lend that boy the wisdom and strength he will need. 
I miss it, you know. Lake Util and Gormont. What? Exactly. Remember when the two of us would shake off the servants and go swimming there? Um, uh, yes. Of course. Kids from the nearby village would come too. Good times. Majesty. If more Ardain, no, the whole of all rest, could be like that again, wouldn't it be beautiful? Is that my new duty then? In truth, it should have been you sitting in this chair right now. The Imperial line has always passed from father to son. On the day your majesty was born, that's exactly what happened. I knew that day would come. It came as no surprise. You were raised by my father to take the throne of the Empire. As befits the daughter of my Lord Uncle Andrig. And I am grateful for it. If not for him, I would never have met Bridget. Never have met them. I'd have missed out on so much. There. Those are your true feelings. <sighs> A magnificent power resides in you. Morak, power like yours exists to be used. Nile. You've been tied down long enough. Follow your heart, Morag Lidair. I have no words. Thank you, Your Majesty. Very well, then. I hereby accept the task you have assigned to me. That's the Morag I know and love. Make me proud. Wow. So that's how it is. It seems our paths continue to entwine. That's awesome news. To be honest, I was really hoping there was some way you could stick around. I was just thinking of asking you myself. Saved you the trouble, did I? That you did. Thanks a bunch, Morag. I can't help but feel that in all the confusion surrounding Banner, our concerns have been neatly swept aside. The Praetorium maintains absolute control over blade distribution. It is quite vexing. Awakening rates from natural cores are very low, which limits the pool of compatible drivers. So to create large numbers of drivers, the cleansing Indol provides is a necessity. That much I'm willing to accept. The real problem is the fact that the Aegis has awakened. Now, this is no time to be squabbling over territory. If we misread the situation even a little, Uriah itself could be sunk to the Cloud Sea's bed. Emperor Nile must surely be thinking the same thing. That's why he sent his precious Morag to shepherd them along. And now we find ourselves in their debt. Who could have predicted such an act of selflessness? Was it just the passion of youth? Or was it... M my liege? In any case... For now, we should keep our troops mobilized while we monitor the situation. I hardly expect Tantal will comply with the Praetor's plan so easily, either. Alright. 
Now. I'm going to throw more egg and Zeke in there. I'm going to play with the healer. Actually, I don't want to play with more egg. Alright. So, this has been quite the episode, hasn't it? I'm going to end the episode here. Maybe a bit early, but... Actually, I'm going to do some blade openings. As I go over... What just freaking happened this episode? Holy crap! I did not expect this for the start of a chapter. Can't open it yet? Alright. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have more egg and Zeke open a rare core crystal each. Each with max boosters. Alright? That's what's gonna happen right now. And then the two of them, the, the Rex and Nia are gonna get one. Also, that was a very interesting transition there. Get one coming. So. Nile died. Along with Bana. Bana's dead. Uh. Rose is gone. Nia has an alternate form that we have little to no information about, except that it can revive dead people. And Dromark knows about it, because he, he seemed kind of understanding of what she was going to do. And Morg's going to come with us. Niall is alive now. And, uh... We haven't even started our trip to Tantal yet. No, I don't want to set the blade. Wow. That was some crazy stuff. I did not expect this episode to be anything crazy. I didn't expect anything crazy to happen at the start of the chapter. I thought I was okay. Okay, let's get started. Let's get started with this chapter. Let's get it moving along a little. Let's start let's start getting to the good stuff. Uh, yeah, we are already at good stuff. We haven't even gone to Tantal yet, which I'm assuming is where we're going to be going for this. Because people have been talking about it a lot in the game. Not in real life. That's not, not an association I make. God, my toe. Ah, I don't know what's up with my toe right now. I just curled it a little in shooting pain. Ugh. All right, and then Nia, that's one. I think that's going to be the setup for giving out core crystals for a while now. It's going to be two rares to uh, the um, the new party members, and then commons to the old ones. Because I think the old party members, Nia and, Tor Nia and uh, Rex, they have more than enough rares. Oops, wrong button. That's not start. <laughs> they have more than enough rare blades. More again, uh, Zeke. They need more. So, next episode, I'm assuming we're going to Tanto. Uh, I did, I forgot I was planning on it, but I forgot at the start of the episode to show off the main screen, the uh, the title screen, which background has changed for for this chapter. Uh, so I will I will start off the next episode with that. Let's end it off. Let, let's see. Let's see how good this person's dialogue is for the end of the episode. Lady Fan's funer, funerary service was so solemn and grand. True. I will probably never forget her beauty, nor the pain of losing such a pure and noble soul. I wonder what would become of Indol without Lady Fan. I hope that the peace we enjoy will continue, but I cannot help but worry. Yep. So. Yep, Lady Fan is is dead too. That dude. This stuff just happens. Boom, 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 one after another. Good lord, Fan dies. We cut right back. Uh Niall dies. And then he freaking comes back. <laughs> Good lord. 
Who expected that? All right. Well, next episode, I'm go I'm going to record another episode right now. As bad of an idea as it probably is, I'm going to record another episode right now. Uh, then I'm going to show off the title screen. So, don't die for the next video. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.